Hi guys, this is Sarah from The Savvy Professor, and in today's video, we're going to talk about how to check ketones. Watch this video until the end to learn various ways you can do ketone tests. You can check ketone through a blood ketone test or a urine ketone test. Both methods are effective and very simple to carry out. Let's start with how you can do a blood ketone test. You will need a blood ketone test kit. You'll find the links to our top two recommendations in the description box below. Number one, start by putting a blood ketone strip into the blood ketone meter. Number two, using a lancet, prick one of your fingers. Number three, hold your finger over the ketone strip to allow some drops of blood into it. Number four, Check the instructions to know how long you should wait to get the result. Wait for the required time and check your ketone results. After getting the results, disregard the ketone strip and the lancet safely. Now, let's look at how you can do a urine ketone test. This test requires ketone test strips. The links to our top two recommendations are in the description box. Number 1. Check the expiry date of your ketone strip to ensure it's good for use. Number 2. Remove the ketone strip from the container. Be careful not to touch the spongy end of the strip. Number 3. You can collect urine in a container and dip the testing area of the ketone strip into the urine or pass urine over the testing area of the ketone strip. Number 4. Start timing immediately after you've passed urine over the testing area of the strip. To know how long you should wait after applying the urine, check the instructions in the manual guide. Number 5. The strip will start changing color with time. Number 6. After waiting for the instructed time, compare the color of the strip to the color chart provided on the side of the container of your ketone strip. Ignore any color changes that may take place after the instructed time is passed. What do different ketone results represent? Less than 0.6 mmol per liter shows normal blood ketones are being produced. 0.6 to 1.5 mmol per liter shows that more blood ketones are being produced than normal. 1.6 to 3.0 mmol per liter shows a high level of blood ketones being produced. This could result in a risk of ketoacidosis. Above 3.0 mmol per liter shows a dangerous level of blood ketones is being produced. This level requires immediate medical care. So, there you have it. With this video, you can easily check your blood ketones. Thanks for watching, till next time.